Greetings, R. Smalik here, and I am floating above a creation map by Sky's World. This is uh, his interpretation, or her interpretation, I'm not actually sure, of the Maze Runner map. Uh, the Glade and the Maze from the Maze Runner book and uh, movie series. It's fairly popular right now among teens. Um, it's kind of movie you either you really like or you really don't like. Uh, the story's simple, and, but what what I liked about it is that it's something that my uh, my son, who is a tween, um, found on his own, really enjoyed, and then asked me to read the book so that we could discuss it together. And so uh, that was cool. I also like sort of the overgrown rune. Uh, sort of atmosphere, the sinister, dark, post-apocalypse feel to it. Uh, so I enjoy the series. I've finished the first book. I'm on the second. But that is not at all why I'm talking to you today. Uh, I wanted to give you just a quick update. I am currently working on my October uh, episode of Minecraft Map History. And that should be out um, within the next two weeks, maybe, maybe sooner. We'll see. Uh, but definitely before the end of October. Uh, I have, a, as always, a list of maps I want to review. But first and foremost on that list is the first entry uh, in the Vanilla Challenge Part 2. I, I didn't really make an official Vanilla Challenge, uh, but I started building a custom adventure map in Minecraft Vanilla. No creative mode, no tools, uh, no external object command blocks nothing like that just pure vanilla survival pure vanilla map play and i'm almost done 85 percent done uh creating that custom adventure map but others in the community picked up the challenge and also started working on maps and so you can you can read all about that or well i guess you can hear all about that in my color of infinity series uh, but Felonious Wizard is the first, as far as I can tell, uh, the first map maker to actually release his map, his his uh, vanilla map, and it has an intriguing, intriguing title. Uh, I almost said awesome, but then I thought that word is overused. And anyway, uh, it's called If the Answer Is No. So it is a story-based map. From what I am aware, it has something like a computer simulation game inside of a computer simulation game, which is Minecraft, inside of a computer simulation. It's one of those head twisty things. Uh, he's done a lot of intriguing things with music. Oh, uh, what am I saying? Music. With vocabulary. <laughs> With vocabulary, with pronunciation of words, he really is trying to capture an alien-like um, setting, if you will. So I don't, I know, I know about the map from his vlogs, but I don't know that much about the map. So I'm really eager to check that one out. Um, that'll probably be the next thing I play. I have a few other maps that have been on my list for a while, a couple new additions that I'm sort of constantly juggling. I will at some point continue to play From Greener Pastures. Uh, that's a map that you have to, I have to be in the right mood for a CTM. I have to be in the right mood for creating custom maps. Uh, and I have to be in the right mood for playing maps. And so those factors juggle my maps around. I've been talking for quite some time now, and I'm just now getting to the actual point of this vlog. This happened. Yes, this did happen. That is a series on my channel. We're in season two. This is going to be a weekly series, and I just wanted to give a quick shout out and let you know that there are bonus episodes that exist in this world. Dun, dun, dun. So that's a series in which Jiggerbov and I play custom maps from the Minecraft forums. We tend to pick maps that have a randomly weird name and no screenshots and just play them and see what happens. Uh, sometimes the maps are good. Sometimes the maps are like a dead fish choking on a snowman. Uh, sometimes the maps are mediocre. But in almost all cases, I think we're pretty entertaining. 
Uh, I, I keep cracking myself up just listening to us react to what we find in these maps. And a lot of times we are surprised in a good way, in a bad way. You find out the series is called This Happened. Season 2 is out. It's going to be a weekly series. You can go back and watch Season 1. Uh, in Season 2, we start off playing maps with Eraja, who is one of my patrons on patreon.com slash uh, very grateful to all those folks, but he's also become a friend, and um, we played, we actually played two maps. I lost the footage for one of the maps, and Jig didn't record it, so uh, on my channel, you can find Season 2, Episode 1 of This Happened, and over on Arija's channel, um, but the map that, that I actually have the footage for is called The Adventures to Kill Monica, which is really weird. And not what I thought it was going to be, but on um, Arija's channel, which is Arija Lost, uh, he has all the footage of a map that we played uh, called The Bobby Chronicles. And it has some funny stuff in it. If you want to laugh and you want to see two guys that are goofy together and a guy that you know, we were just getting used to, we had, didn't really know him yet, but we asked him to play a random map with us, and he was probably like, what the heck are you guys pulling me into? Um, go watch the Bobby Chronicles on Arise's channel. Also, uh, so that is an exclusive for Arise. Also, I lost the footage for two other maps that we played, Jigger Bob and I, with the Q Magnet. And I don't, I don't know, something weird has been going on with my fraps. It it didn't film Minecraft, it filmed Skype, or it filmed my server window, even though the little red uh, fraps uh, FPS markers were in Minecraft. So I had no idea it wasn't filming, but I lost my footage. It's really annoying. And I don't know, it might have to do with Java 8, because I've never in three years had this happen to me. But I digress again. And so on Jigarbov's channel, Jigarbov LP, uh, you can actually find the footage for two, ma two more maps that we played as part of the series that you won't see on this channel. Uh, one is called The Lost Sun, which is pretty much uh, describes what it is. Uh, you have to find someone's son that was kidnapped. And the second one was called The Trip, which is basically, well, it, it starts off with you in a six-wheeled car about to take a trip with your grandparents. And that's all I'll say about it. Go watch them. Uh, they are pretty hysterical in, again, uh, you know, Q Magnet, experienced map maker, Jiggerball, brilliant map maker, uh, myself. Um, I get people into mischievous trouble. And... Uh, Go watch those exclusive episodes of This Happened and then, you know, keep tuning in because we have a bunch of maps this season. Uh, the season's pretty much already recorded. I think we recorded uh, 11 maps and I'm going to air eight of them and then we're, I'm hoping we can record two more for my channel. So we'll have a full 10 weeks, full 10 episodes in this season. Uh, so that's coming. Color of Infinity will continue. Uh, it's getting close to the end. Uh, to Greener Pastures will continue. The Adventurers. Uh, <laughs> Dads are funny, and I started playing that map over a year ago, and we're still pretty much weekly pinging each other, hey, can you play it this time? Can you play it this time? We will find time to play it uh, and finish it and have more Agent Flint and Steel Adventures and all of the other series Cap captive minecraft 2 with orange 1095 i really want to play a bit more of it i i will tell you uh one of the things that has deprioritized that from my list is i have absolutely no desire zero desire to fight the ender dragon in vanilla survival um which is basically, well, no, that map ends after you beat the Ender Dragon, you have to beat the Wither, which I really don't have a desire to do that either. But I do want to unlock a couple more achievements in that map, and we, we'll continue it, I hope, uh, if Orange and I can connect on schedules uh, across, you know, six time zone differences. 
of uh, of the world. But um, but yeah, so more stuffs coming on the channel. Uh, if if you're at all interested in kind of a, a post-apocalypse, kids, uh, you know, teenagers trapped in a well, a maze, <laughs> if you see it under me, uh, trying that are on on like being tested. They're you know they're being trialed. I guess. Uh, check out the Maze Runner. I mean, it's definitely written for a younger audience, but it was interesting. And again, uh, to me, it has special, uh, special memories, you know, for, for my son and I. So uh, check out that book or movie. And I think that's it. October Map History coming soon. This has been a lot longer than I intended, but um, go check out This Happened Season 1. Check out my first and maybe my second episode of Season 2, depending when you watch this. And then go check out the exclusive uh, episodes on Erija Lost Channel and on Jiggerbov LP. So, uh, that's it for this ramble vlog. <laughs>